Hey guys, it's Annabelle. So today I wanted to do our six week updates for you guys. I haven't talked to you guys for a couple weeks. We've been busy um, with Easter and we were gone and all of that kind of fun family travel kind of stuff and um, just been loving the outdoors lately. Um, I'm still trying to get used to it, still being light outside this late. So that's fantastic. Um, and we've been also getting into our routine and kind of settling down in that routine with me working from home again now. So it's just been awesome. Okay, so just a quick update on me. Um, I am doing fabulous. Um, I feel great. I'm doing great. It's all awesome. Um, I had my six-week check and everything. Everything went well. Um, I am a little bit like swollen like inside and things like that but um, my doctor doesn't see any potential for it to be like serious or anything like that um, and just that um, my son was a big boy for my body so um, he wasn't concerned it did concern me a little bit just because like everything hasn't like 100% like healed and stuff in there. Um, but another month or so and apparently everything will be like back to normal and all ready to go. Um, so that is it on me. Um, I've been like just working out and been busy and we've been outside and going a lot. So um, that's like everything that we've been up to. Um, little man is six week update. Oh my goodness. He is such a big boy and I will um, do a video and show him what he looks like now. Um, he has changed a little bit so it's very exciting. Um, so since my last update, we took his one month pictures. So that was very exciting. We did, um, we're kind of doing the ones um, similar to my daughter's. These first um, like three months are going to be very similar to my daughter's pictures. Her birth pictures, her one month pictures, two month pictures, and three month pictures will all kind of look similar. Um, my daughter's um, one month pictures were of her just like in her diaper and with like a pink and black back, pink, black, and white um, background. And his was brown, blue, and white. So we're kind of doing the same of the ones that we can. Now, like obviously we're not gonna do a month picture of him in a princess outfit like we did for my daughter. Um, so those will be more like geared towards like boy things. Um, but anyway, so we took his one month pictures. Um, we just had six week appointment today. So that was very exciting. And little man again made a huge jump in his weight. He is just shy of 13 pounds. Holy cow, I cannot believe how big he is. Um, he's just doing fabulous. Um, with my daughter when she was little, um, we only had to give her a bath probably once a week. Um, and that's all my doctor said that we needed to give her a bath. Um, my son, however, he is a sweaty boy. Um, so we've been giving him a bath two or three times a week. Um, but he is just growing and just, he's just awesome. Um, he isn't really crying a whole lot. He only cries when he's hungry. If he doesn't like what he's doing, um, we've started putting him on um, the floor gym and things um, where like the baby stuff like hangs from it. Um, and he likes to look at the lights that are underneath it and everything. Um, but he does that. He also does tummy time and um, just all that kind of fun stuff. And so if he starts to get bored with like laying underneath the gym or being on his tummy, he'll kind of like just squawk a little bit. And one of my friends was like, why are you saying your baby squawks? But he does. It's, it's like literally like a squawk when he's like uncomfortable or doesn't like what he's doing. So we just change positions and everything like that. He loves to sit up straight and he loves to work on like putting his head up. He loves to lift his head and like look at you and look at what's like going on, like what he can kind of like see. Um, he does like um, high contrast things like black and white. Um, 
most of the things in our living room are like in black frames against a white wall. So he loves to look at like that contrast of like the frames on the wall and things like that. He has found all of the ceiling fans and he loves to stare at bright lights. Um, those are like his favorite things to do right now. Um, he almost like got himself um, into like a rollover um, like position when he was on like our floor gym one day and I was just like oh my gosh you got to be kidding me he is not rolling over yet like there's no way he can roll over yet but he had it where he was about halfway there and I thought he was gonna go all the way but he turned back over so all of this stuff is just happening again just too fast too fast um, I think I said it in my last video that I can wait for him to um, do the next thing and do the next thing. I'm enjoying where he's at right now and what he's doing and it's just it, the face to face time is my favorite part where we do different things like I raise my eyebrows up and down and see if he copies me or I stick my tongue in and out and see if he copies me um, and just kind of move my mouth and see if he does it too. Um, and it's just, it's just a great time when they're just this little. So, but he's still such a big boy, even though he is still little. I keep telling my husband, I'm like, he's heavy. And my husband's like, no, he's not. He's like super light. But and in comparison to my daughter, he is super light. But I just, with him being little and a baby, like he's heavy. Um, Everything with um, breastfeeding um, at night and overnight is working out well. Um, the only time that it um, is uncomfortable for me is when he is not waking up at night. Um, and then I am not waking up in the middle of the night either. So I am like full, full in the morning. And it is kind of painful, uncomfortable just from being that full with like breast milk and things. Um, he is taking the bottle great. Um, just this week, he has started, um, it seems like he's taking in more air. Um, because he is doing this where he's like, he's trying to get like so much out of um, the bottle and he's like sucking really really hard and not taking a breath and then he stops um, to take some breath so I think that's when he's like swallowing some air um, so he's had some like burping and just a little bit of like spit up like nothing major not a lot or anything like that but otherwise he is just a little little man but he's so strong and getting so big what's the matter you went up to, oh, somebody wants to say hi. You say hi? Hi. hi. She's like, hey. up. You wanted to say hi, huh? <laughs> you see yourself? Say hi. Hi. I know. Is that fun? Hi. Do you have anything to say about your little brother? Yes. Yes? What do you have to say about your little brother? He is six weeks old. Do you want to tell everybody something about him? I sleep all day. He sleeps all day? Yes. Yes? Well, he sleeps most of the day. Um, <laughs> that's a good, good thing to bring up. Mm. Nah. Um, he wakes up about like 6.45, 7 o'clock-ish is when he is like getting up. And he, so he is my little alarm clock. Um, and he's up usually all morning and then sleeps um, pretty consistently and everything throughout the afternoon from 11 to anywhere about three. And then he's usually up for the majority of the night. He might snooze just a little bit, but now he's going to bed when, right after she goes to bed. And she goes to bed at 8.30. And so he's going, he's like in bed sleeping by nine. And, <laughs> He still is mostly waking up one time a night, but he is, it's <laughs> two or three nights a week he's been sleeping all night long, which is awesome. Um, so I'm hoping that by the time he is two months old that he'll be sleeping through the night, but 
He's eating great. He's eating about um, 26 to 27 ounces every day. Um, yesterday he only drank like 23 ounces, but he slept um, quite a bit um, last evening and he has slept quite a bit um, today as well. So I'm thinking we're going through another little growth spurt and everything. My great grandma is like, babies grow when they sleep. So we'll see if that's true. Can you see? You're like pushing on Bye. me. You're pushing on me. I don't, can we think of anything else to say about brother? Yes. Yes? What else can we say about brother? Um, this much. You love him this much? That's so cute. She loves him this much. I wanted to show him your arms. That's too funny. <laughs> Alrighty. Well, anyways, if there's any questions or comments, leave them below. Otherwise, I will talk to you guys later. And if I forgot anything, I will put it in the description box below. But otherwise, I will talk to you guys later. Bye. Oh, I'm coming.